In this video, you will find out more about price change alert emails, how you can set them up and customize them according to your own preferences. Once your account has been set up and the product URL is added, Price to Spy will start monitoring the added product pages for price and availability changes on a regular basis in an automated way. Each time Price to Spy detects a price change, it will by default send you an automated alert email. So here is an example of one such email. The alert emails contain only products where a price change has been detected. Additionally, the price change that triggered the alert email will be highlighted in green. You will be able to see previous price changes not only for the highlighted site, but all previously detected changes on other sites. Alert emails also tell us when availability of a product changes, if a product goes in or out of stock. The last change column will show you when exactly each one of the listed changes occur. Color coding. Besides the green color that highlights the most recent price change, you might notice some of the following colors as well. Blue indicates the first price captured. This color usually appears when the URLs are imported to the account or when a URL has been found via automatch process and after the first price checks go through. Yellow indicates that the product is both out of stock and the price is removed from the URL. Orange. If you're also monitoring minimum advertised prices, you will notice some sites are highlighted in orange, which indicates they are selling the product below the targeted levels. Alert email settings. Now that we've shown you how an alert email looks like, we can discuss different email settings. You can access all email settings in the account settings section under email settings. Here you can see your login email, which is the default email address Price to Spy will be sending all alert emails to. However, if you wish other members from your team to receive these emails as well, you're welcome to add additional email recipients. Alert email frequency. As for alert email frequency, you can choose to receive the emails instantly, as soon as we detect a price change, daily. In this case, all detected changes will be listed in a single email. You can choose the exact time when you would like to have this email in your inbox, so keep in mind that the changes we detected in the previous 24 hours in reference to the selected time will be taken into consideration. Weekly. If you choose this setting, you will receive one email per week with all the price changes that occurred during that time. Monthly. You can choose this option if you wish to receive one email per month with all the price changes listed. And lastly, you can choose not to receive any emails at all. You can always check out the latest price changes in the most recent price changes in the dashboard section. Deactivation emails. Below, you can see an option to choose whether you wish to receive deactivation emails, so we'll shortly explain what this means. URL deactivation alert is a feature that notifies you via email that one or more of the URLs that are monitored have been deactivated. Besides mere notification, by default, it provides you with a list of all other sites offering this product, so you have all the competitors at a glance. You can choose not to see other competitor active URLs in the email by checking the box, in case this info is not relevant to you. These deactivations can happen for a number of reasons, for example, a product being discontinued, the site not responding, or there has been a change in the product page or layout design. However, receiving deactivation emails is optional, meaning it is up to you to decide whether you want to receive URL deactivation alerts or not. If you do not want to receive them, just check off the corresponding box. Splitting alert emails. In case you need to split your alert emails per brand, category, supplier, or competitor group, for example, if different members of your team are in charge of different product groups, or you just wish to get a more systematic alerting, you can split your alert emails according to this criterion. It's important to remember that once you set this in your account, you will need to assign a corresponding email recipient to each group of products, brand, category, or supplier. In case alert emails are split by brand, a recipient for each brand must be listed in metadata brands. If the recipient field is left empty, the email won't be sent at all. Sorting URLs within price change alert emails. You can decide how you would like to have the URL sorted in your alert emails. There are four options. The URLs can be sorted by 
product price in ascending or descending order, alert emails will list URLs within a single product from the cheapest to the highest price or vice versa. Date of last change in ascending or descending order. Alert emails will list URLs within a single product from the most recent to the least recent price changes or vice versa. Email alert trigger options. You can also customize to which extent you will be notified about price changes. Maybe you want to see all price changes, but maybe you only want to see when someone drops a price below yours. You can go even into more detail and say that you want to be notified only if someone changes their price by a certain percentage you can define yourself or by an absolute number. What if you don't wish to be alerted of your own price changes? If you check this box, we won't be notifying you about any price or availability changes detected on your own site. Focusing on URLs with price changes only. If you don't wish to see any previous price changes nor any prices that haven't changed from the last price check, you can choose to include only URLs with price changes. Here is how such email would look like. You can see that for this particular product, only one price change has been detected, so only one URL is displayed in the alert email. Alert emails for availability changes. By default, we will notify you if we detect availability changes, but you can choose to turn off this option and receive alerts for price changes only. Subject of alert emails. To make it easier for you to find and notice the alert emails in your inbox, you can change the subject of your alert emails. Just type in the desired subjects for both price change alert emails and deactivation emails and click Save. From that moment on, all alert emails you receive from Price to Spy will have a subject you defined yourself. Alert email fields. In case you're monitoring some other product info besides the price and availability, and this is being captured in an additional field, you can decide on the fields that you wish to see in your alert emails. Check the boxes of fields you wish to see and uncheck the boxes of fields you don't find relevant and click Confirm. These fields will be displayed in all alerts from the moment you set this up. What if you don't wish to receive alert emails for detected changes on particular sites you're monitoring? You can exclude some sites from the alerting process completely. To do this, just click on your profile name, site maintenance, and find the site you wish to exclude. Click on the pencil icon, set exclude price and availability changes from alert email options to on, and click save. From this moment on, you won't be notified about any price or availability changes detected on this site. You have seen that you can customize the way you're being notified about any price or availability changes yourself, so we're hoping you will be able to make good use of our flexible solution. In case you have any questions regarding the alerting mechanism, please feel free to contact us at support at